Okay, there's a question about uh, tips for arthritis. Well, remember that itises are infl inflammation. So Goodhart said often it's where there's a muscle imbalance that we get inflammation. So you always want to balance the muscles. Again, we cover that a lot in the structural course as well as the advanced courses of the energy. We cover one muscle for each meridian. Um, and then we cover in biochemical one muscle for each organ. So you get a deeper uh, understanding of that. Again, I'll see if I can demonstrate some of that later in our class today. But you want to balance energy, you want to balance muscles. But there's basically three primary things that cause inflammation. One is foods and food sensitivities. That's why we do food testing. We'll cover that yet today when you're doing in self-testing foods. When you, you find foods that you test weak on, they are irritants to your system and they cause inflammation. Now, another thing that causes inflammation is uh, imbalances in the microbiome, which would be like too much bad bacteria, like small intestine bacterial overgrowth, and not enough good bacteria, like um, your bifidus, your acidophilus, and your probiotics. Uh, another thing is lack of um, essential fatty acids. That's omega-3s. Omega-3s are natural anti-inflammatories. Um, give me an example of um, like fish oils. I think it was Dr. Deal who was talking to me about um, if someone had like a, a really a, a bad, um, I think it was even a brain tumor they had. And he said, oh, have flaxseed take uh, two or three tablespoons of flaxseed oil every day and it can reduce the tumor. Now, it wasn't a cancerous tumor, but he said that would be a great way to reduce it. So also, um, I had a joint inflammation where my, I had a frozen shoulder and a knee that was a huge pain. And I was back in my marathon and triathlon days and I go, God, I can't do the, the race. So I went on an alkaline diet. Alkaline is non-acidic. Uh, acid foods are inflammatory. Just think if you get acid on your hands, it burns it, right? So I got on an alkaline cleanse and totally got rid of my joint inflammation. Two days, my knee pain went away. Three days, I was doing like only alkalizing foods, which are basically your plant-based things you get out of the garden. You know, your broccoli, your kale, your cauliflower, fibrous vegetables, which also help liver detox because the toxic liver creates inflammation. So you're wanting to detox and alkalize and the omega-3s help. And then there is a fourth thing, is toxic thoughts. When you're worrying, that can be the most acidifying thing of all. So that's why today, with all this you know, fear and panic and all that going on, you wanna focus on gratitude, you wanna focus on the things that make you feel good, and focusing on your, your loving relationships where you feel love, where you feel gratitude uh, and faith, faith and hope and trust. Those are the things that are good for arthritis, okay?